the thumbnail is not clickbait now in denmark a very weird tradition is practiced every new year it is different from your normal pleasantries Why it might be famous for the Greeks to smash plates during celebratory occasions, it is popular over in Denmark too. In fact, on New Year's Eve, the people of Denmark throw unused plates that have been saved up throughout the year at the front doors of family and friends for good luck. So basically, what they believe in is that the more plates you find outside your house, the more luck you have in the New Year. I, and I'm not quite sure I like this kind of celebration though. Personally speaking, I'll, I'll prefer a WhatsApp sticker to flying plates. I think that will just be much safer. Anyways, I'm not from Denmark though. But stick around. Because things just got dark. New Year's Eve's tradition takes the resident of Tauka chill to their local cemeteries for a sleepover. And you he heard that right. It is customary for residents of Tauka to go to their cemeteries for sleepover. And you might be wondering, what the f why do they do this? Now, it is in their belief that their dead loved ones come back to the graveyard to celebrate with them. So they host this party by making fires, bringing meals and decorating the graves. And when they decide to call it a night, then set up their beds and sleep. So basically, they lay with the dead so as to celebrate New Year. And that is very creepy, okay? Now, we have just talked about one. What about the other? In Ecuador, it is a popular tradition to celebrate the new year by setting fire to a scarecrow-like doll called a money goat, which literally means the old year. This tradition is said to represent getting rid of regrets or letting go of the bad things from the previous year. And it's also a medium for pyromaniacs to express themselves and just set things on fire and that is another shocking tradition that happens around the world on new year and i bet you didn't know that but enough of this scary shit stop the music stop the music for some more fun facts dropping your ice cream on the ground has always been a very painful thing dropping your ice cream on the ground has always been a very very horrible scenario but to others it is a tradition but to me it is a very very devastating tragedy my ice cream fell alongside my heart and I could only take two bites before it came crashing down. Oh, how unfair life is. My sweet little ice cream gone like the wind. But in Switzerland, such kind of behavior is actually encouraged. In Switzerland, it's thought to be good luck to drop ice cream on the ground on New Year's Day. Any ice cream you walk, it does not matter the flavor as long as it's on the ground. Uh, and I don't think I'll like this tradition very well. You see this tradition and that um, throwing plates tradition this two it's really contrasts with me greatly but i'm not from switzerland so in some other countries the color of your underwear can also represent good luck it's also a tradition for new year so if you're in a mood for some love and romance during this new year then wearing red underwear is a must and yellow wearing yellow underwear helps to signify wealth and money um, wearing white is if you are hoping for peace and tranquility 
especially if you're married to all these modern day women we have now all these modern day feminists i think you really need to put on some white underwear and these are just some shocking traditions that are practiced around the world for new year's celebration now do you know that there's a literal dick festival that is celebrated by japan please click the card on screen or go over to the description below and click the link to go over to that video please make sure to subscribe